Hi, uh, my name is Raja and welcome to my first screencast. Well, basically I got inspired uh, to do screencasts after seeing my friend Danny. Uh, well, he's got some pretty good ones on his site, so you should check it out. I'll pass you all the link later. Okay, anyway, um, this screencast is about creating Facebook badges. So, well, the use of these Facebook badges is basically like uh, if you're a frequent forum user, most of these uh, people they have signatures well the signatures are usually like pictures or quotes of theirs some guys might have seen uh, an, an xbox live gamer card or maybe their bandwidth test results basically uh, what these signatures do is they link back to facebook and they will get whatever information you put in your facebook badge okay let me show you how to create one Okay, as you can see here, this here is my profile, my Facebook profile, and if you scroll all the way down, you'll see this option, create a profile badge. Okay, so let's click on that. Okay, um, once this page loads up, you'll see that I've already got two Facebook badges. And, okay, let me tell you more about these badges. There are basically two types of badges. There's one which is... Uh, vertical and another which is horizontal actually it's the other way around but uh, okay so uh, I'll show you how to make a new Facebook badge there are three templates for those of you who kinda lack uh, ideas there's the photo badge which I'm not really going to show you because I don't have many photos here there's the signature badge this one is quite good for forums if you want as you can see uh, this will show you quite a bit on of info and you can actually edit them if you want there's another badge and that's the block badge uh, this one is a uh, horizontal uh, this is a vertical badge and well if you like it you may want to put it in your blog okay let me show you how to create one now all you have to do is click on create badge and what I'll do here is I'll create a Facebook badge which is exactly the same as what I put on my website right now okay for my website I chose the horizontal layout and what I did was I added my profile pic I think all of you guys would wanna do that and also my name well I took off my networks and instead I added my status let's find the status here and I also added my website so well yeah this is something like what I have on my website right now okay uh, you have two two sorts of formats there the, there's the image as well as the JavaScript version I'd recommend you use the JavaScript version because uh, well if uh, JavaScript version is a bit more interactive and I'll show you how useful it is in a while okay let's just use JavaScript here and once I've done that let's save this badge okay once you've uh, saved this badge uh, well you have this code you can embed in any page of yours and well, that will display this particular badge let's have a look at my website uh, if I about page on the website okay youth book badge and you have my name my status and my website if you look at and when I click on this what happens is it actually loads my public Facebook profile so it's a pretty interesting thing and the more important part is you can actually put your website here and when users click on it it goes straight back to my main website so that's gotta be pretty good for all you link calls around uh, well I think that would be it for today's screencast maybe we'll see some other time what I can do thank you goodbye